This is Pico CTF 2025. We are going to complete the challenge hash crack in the cryptography category. The company stored the secret message on a server which got breached due to the admin using weekly hashed passwords. Can you gain access to the secret stored within the server? Access the server using netcat and then the IP address. Okay. So let's copy this. And let's head to the terminal. Let's see what we have to work with. Uh, looking for the secret, we have it identified the hash and it gives us the hash. Okay. So the first step is going to be figuring out what kind of hash this is. My guess is it's MD5. But we have CyberChef that can help us um, get more information. So let's see. Analyze hash. And let's put the hash over here. Okay, hash length 32 based on the length to be generated MD5, MD4, and then less common ones. Right. So CyberChef thinks it's also MD5. Okay, what I'm going to do is try to use uh, John the Reaper, which is a tool for cracking weak hashed passwords. However, there are two versions of John the Reaper. There is the standard version. Control Shift O to open a new terminal. So the normal version we have installed here there you can see it's version 1.9.0, right? That's the normal version. And if you look at the format of the hashes, it doesn't recognize raw MD5. It's just MD5 crypt, which isn't the hash we have over here, right? But there is a second version of John the Reaper, and I have it installed over here. And if you look, this one is version 190 Jumbo. And that's the list. As you can see, it's much, much bigger. But as we know already that we're looking for MD5, these are the default MD5 here. We have to copy the hash. Let's paste it over here and put it in a file. Let's call it hash.txt. And so what are we going to do now? Format is going to be a raw MD5 and then against the hash.txt. Add this. Password123. Okay. So let's try the password that John the Reaper has provided. You've cracked the MD5 hash with no secret. Crack this hash. Okay, so that's another hash. Let's see what Cyberchef says about this uh, bigger hash. SHA-1. Hash2.txt. And again, let's run John against this new hash. And the password is let me in. So let's copy the password, paste it here. Okay. And then the third hash, let's see what format this hash is in. Shot to five, six. Let's do the same thing, echo, and then the hash. And this is going to be hash3.txt. We're going to tell it, hey, this is actually a SHA-256. And then that's the password. 
There we go. And now the flag is PicoCTF, use strong hashes, passwords, something, something. Okay, so let's copy the flag, pop it over here, submit it, and there we go. If you've enjoyed this, hit the like button. If you'd like to get notified in the future whenever I solve new challenges, hit that subscribe button. And I will see you on the next one. Bye-bye.